Hello guys and welcome to my um, tutorial on C++. Um, today I will be demoing um, my project which is a, a file that contains um, a student, a set of student record. I'm using C++ to um, write to that file. Um, so yeah, let's get on to it. When you launch the project, this uh, menu will show up and will ask you to pick um, from these functions. Right now, my update and delete um, a record um, does not work. However, I can create a student record. I can display all records and I can display a student record particularly. Um, so yeah, let's get down. Um, let's display all the records that are in my CSV file. So it displays the ID of the student, the name of the student and the grades that they have. So basically the record, um, this project, um, grabs this information from a CSV file that um, this project also creates. Um, and it stores information into the CSV file. Okay, let's try one, um, create student record. So it asks you for information such as the ID. So let's give an ID of five, the name of the student, John. And it asks them for their marks. So web development marks, 89, software testing, 90, algorithm, eight, because you know, John Wick is pretty intelligent. And it sends you a note, so a record of John Wick has been created. So all of that information I just added um, was automatically read into uh, a CSV file that I am opening um, in the codes. And all of this information that I've just um, collected from the user is added to that CSV file. So now when I cl click, um, display all students too, it should show John Wick inside of that um, CSV file. So there it is, John Wick. So now that I just want to see John Wick's information, I should click display a student record to so option three. Remember John Wick ID is five. So it says enter the ID of that student. So I enter five and it shows all of John Wick's um, information. Um, so John Wick's name, his scores and various, um, um, each of those um, subjects. And it also calculates a grade for John Wick and John Wick scored a grade A. So yeah, that's what the project does. And I'll show you the background of how it is um, set up. So here I am using a class called student um, inside it has um, public variables or attributes and it also has public functions or methods. Um, I am using, uh, I'm defining these methods outside of the class. So I have to use void students and with these colons, and then I'm displaying what these functions should do that are part of the class. Um, here is where I um, take these information that's given from the user and I'm placing it inside of the file. So of fstream file, I'm opening um, file is CSV and I am placing all of these information inside of um, the CSV file and I'm separating them by comma because we all know CSV files are comma separated files. 
and then I close my file. I'm also taking those uh, marks that we just added and that we just put in for John Wick and I'm making an average of it. Then I'm taking an average and I'm seeing what grade, letter grade that person deserves. Um, this is for show all information. So here I'm also opening the CSV file. Um, I'm making a bunch of string um, temporary variables and I'm linking them to those to those uh, different areas in the CSV file and then I'm displaying it. So yeah, it does that over and over. And this is my main function, which calls, um, shows the menu and then calls those specific function based on what the user chooses. So yeah, that's my program so far. I hope that you enjoy it. I did enjoy myself writing C++ and learning the syntax. Um, so yeah, thank you. And